Where are all the spider fit kids? Who's ready to get off the couch and move? Hey, spider fit kids, Coach Brett here. It's Thursday, and you know what that means? It means it's Thursday, and that's the day we move. Now, today, if you remember, today is crazy mismatch day. So this doesn't look too bad. And then, you know, I come back out by my blue shorts, and then I got my socks, I got my blue socks and my yellow shoes. Who's there with me? Isla is ready, I like it. I wanna see those crazy mismatches. Zach, you're ready. Zach Huber, you're ready. I wanna see those crazy mismatches. And I can't wait. We got all kinds of new kids added to the clean room club. I can't wait to read it off at the end. It's gonna take so long because there's so many kids with clean rooms. Now, one thing you need today, aside from your crazy mismatch clothes, is we do need a pair of socks. So Shruti and Piper and Axel, you guys need to grab a pair of socks. And that means you, Tanner in Brooklyn, too, with your crazy, crazy clothes. And Caitlin in Sydney. And Mateo is here. Make sure you get your socks because we're going to need these socks today. And your crazy clothes and you're gonna see spider fit kid maddie has her hat on she's got a flannel on with red white and blue she's all over the place so who's ready to have some fun now before we really get started today i want you to look at the set and tell me if you notice anything different what is different if anything there's i'll tell you right now there's two major things different with the set today so who can tell me oh Owen and Henry, you're here. And Lucy is here. I'm so happy. Now, look at the set, and if anybody can tell me what's different with the set, if you can tell me by the end. But meanwhile, grab that pair of socks. We're gonna need that pair of socks. And here we go, let's start. And I just want you to toss up the pair of socks and catch it. I'm gonna give you some new challenges today, because I know some of you came up with some tricks yesterday. Toss it up and catch it. Now, toss it up with one hand, catch it with the other hand. Toss it up with one hand, now, who can toss it up, clap two times, Micah? Who can toss it up, clap two times, and catch it? Now, that was easy. That was easy, Sophie Ann. Now, you're going to go like this. I want you to toss it up, turn around in a circle, and see if you can catch it. <laughs> uh, the ball, the pink mat. No, the pink mat's been there before. It is a little bit different, but there's a couple other things in kind of uh, that area. Uh, Darth Vader and the unicorn. We got it, you guys got it, and the doll is there too. Now I want you to toss up, go and toss up the sock, try to hit it with your thigh, and then catch it. Toss up the sock, hit it with your thigh, and then catch it. So can you do With Darth Vader in it. <laughs> oh, with Darth Vader in it. Toss it up and catch it. Toss it up and catch it. Can you do it with the other thigh? Oh, we got the unicorn, yep, the mats, the doll, and the scooter, and the suitcase. The Brady's got it. Now you're gonna toss it up, hit it with your thigh. Toss it up, hit it with your thigh. Now can you toss up the sock and kick it with your foot? Extra points if you can catch it. All right, so toss up the sock, kick it with your foot, and catch it. All right, toss it up, kick it with your foot, and catch it. See if you can kick it with your foot first. Oops. First, see if you can kick it with your foot, and then catch it. Woo! Kick it with your foot, good. Now, can you throw up the sock and hit it with your shoulder? Let's give that a try. Toss it up. Hit it with your shoulder. Why does this Toss it up. Hit it with your shoulder. Toss it up. Hit it with your shoulder. Good job. Toss it up. Hit it with your shoulder. Okay, now I want you to toss it up. Close your eyes and see if you can catch it. This is like the magic catch. I caught okay. it on my shoulder. Nice job. Closing my eyes. Good job. Now I'm going to throw it up. Close my eyes. Oh, I almost caught it. Let's see who can do it. I want to know who can do it with their eyes closed. That means you're pretty much magic. So I'm going to throw it up. Eyes closed. And catch it. You see that? You saw that. You saw that with your own eyes. I think I might be magic. But aside from that, let's get moving today. So you know how we get moving. Let's start moving our head around. Like if I ask you, do you like ice cream? What would you say? You'd probably say, uh-huh, uh-huh. And if you said, do you want me to put a bunch of broccoli on that ice cream? You'd probably say, oh yes, that sounds so good, right? No, you'd say no. All right, move that head around now. Take your shoulders and up, 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 up. Just like that, move your shoulders up, 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 up. There you go, good. Now your elbows, let's move those elbows around. 
Move those elbows around. Good. Let's see you move those elbows. Good. Now move your hands around. Just like this. Move your hands around. Good job. Now move your hips from side to side. Move your hips from side to side. See if you can walk around the room moving your hips side to side. That's it. Good. Now I want you to bend your knees and straighten your knees. Bend your knees, straighten your knees. Bend your knees, straighten your knees. Bend your knees. Now, can you walk around the room like that? Bend your knees, straighten your knees. Bend your knees. Now walk backwards like that. Bend your knees, straighten your knees. Bend your knees, straighten your knees. Bend your knees, straighten your knees. Good job. Now your ankles. I want you to move your foot around like this. Can you balance and move your foot around? That's it. Can you balance and move your foot around? Good. And can we go to the other leg? Can you balance and move your foot around? Good job. All right, now I'm gonna give you some words and I wanna see if you can do it. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna fly. What would it look like for you to fly? Okay, let's see. For me, this is flying. Go and fly around the room. That's flying. What would it look like you, for you to fly? Oh, be careful. That's it, and fly. Let's see you fly. Okay, now, now we know how to fly. I wanna see you freeze. So if I say freeze, what does that look like to you? This is freeze to me. Let's see a freeze. So fly, and then freeze. Fly, good. Keep flying, keep flying, and freeze. Okay, now what I want you to do is I want you to escape. What would that look like if I said escape? So first, I'm gonna fly, and then I'm gonna freeze, and then I'm gonna escape. All right, now let's fly. Everybody fly. We're gonna fly and freeze and escape and fly and freeze, escape and fly and freeze and escape and fly, freeze, escape. All right, good job, good job. Now I want you to go under something. Now it can be real or imaginary. Mine's gonna be imaginary. So. I'm gonna go under something, just like that. Now go under something, that's it. And let's see you go under something. Imagine it good, let's see you go under something. Good, now we're gonna go around something. It can be imaginary or it can be real. Here we go. So go under, now go around something. Just like that, go under something and then go around something. Good, go under. And then around, good job. And now finally, we're gonna go over something. So we're gonna go under something, around something, and over something. All right, here we go. Help me out, Spider-Fit Kid Maddie. And we're gonna go under something, around something, over something, under, around, over, under, around, over, under, around, over, under, around. Boom! All right, one more. I wanna see if you can come up with one more word challenge. Now, I want you to get big. How big can you get? Okay, let's see you get big. So if I were to get big, spider fit kid, man, I need your help here. How would I get big? So, oh, I'm gonna be big. Walk around the room big. All right, good, big, big, big. Now I want you to walk around the room little. I want you to walk around the room little. So what would that look like? All right, what would that look like? That's it, walk around the room, little, good job. Now walk around big, <laughs> now little, and now little, now big, 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 and little, good job. All right, our heart's pumping. And now what I wanna do is last week, we worked on skipping. I wanna see those arms work while you're skipping. So we're gonna skip around the room just like this. So let's see you skip around the room. Let's see you skip. Remember, arms just like that in little squares. Skip, now I want you to skip with your arms big, with your arms really big. Crazy big arms, good. Skip with your arms. Well, maybe we should, that's it, good. And skip with it. Yeah, we can take this off so we can help out. And just like that, and skip with big arms, that's it. Now I want little arms, little arm swings, just like this. Little arm swings, my arms 
are barely swinging. Skip around, that's it, my arms are barely swinging. They're like little arms. Okay, now we're gonna move on to squats. Now let's see if you know how to do squats. Let's see, let's see you do a squat. Oh, and that looks pretty good. You squat it down to the ground. This is a squat. Make your hips go low, just like that, and stand up. That's a squat. So let's do some squats. Squat down low, squat down, check out those shoes, and come back up. Squat down, check out those shoes, and come back up. Now, we're gonna do that squat, but we're gonna move in a circle. So I'm gonna squat down, move it in a circle. Squat down, move in a circle. Let's see, you move in a circle, and squat. Good job. Move in a circle and squat. Now, we're gonna play a form of red light, green light with the squat. When I say go, you're gonna squat. When I say stop, you're gonna stop wherever you're at. Here we go. Ready? And go. We're gonna squat, good. Squat and stop. And go. Squat right in place, good. And stop. And go. That's it, good, squat down, squat down. Let's show them how to squat, let's show them how to squat. Good, and stop, and go. That's it, let's show them how to squat. Spider Fit Kid Maddie, squat down, and stop. Good job, good job. Now we're gonna gallop. Who knows how to gallop? Step together, step together. Very good, let's show them a gallop. And we're gonna gallop around the room. Step together, step together. Let's see, gallop around the room. Good job. Now I want you to gallop fast. Gallop fast around the room. Good, gallop fast. Now gallop slow. Gallop slow. Good, gallop slow. Now I want you to get back to normal and gallop with your hands high. Gallop with your hands up high. That feels funny. That's a gallop with your hands high. Now gallop with your hands low. How low can you make your hands? I feel like a monkey now. That's it, how low can you gallop? Good job. All right, very good. It's game time. Who wants to play a little bit of a game? Now I'm gonna warn you, we're gonna start easy and then I'm gonna try to trick you. So I want you to use your ears, your super hearing and your super eyes to figure out where I'm trying to trick you. Okay, here's how the game works. I want everybody to stand here just like this. So everybody stand here like this, get a little shake, get your body loose. Now when I say go, we're gonna start moving your feet as fast as you can go. Now when I point that way, you're gonna turn that way. And then back to the middle. And when I point that way, you're gonna turn that way. And then back to the middle. If I point down, if I say down, you're gonna go down to the ground, put your tummy on the ground, and stand back up. If I point up, you're gonna jump. Okay? This is the easy part, okay? Here we go. So, let's get those feet going really fast. Ready, and go. And go, turn, and back to the middle. And turn, back to the middle. And down. We're down, get back up. And get those feet going, and up. And turn, back to the middle, and turn. Back to the middle, and stop, good job. Okay, I warned you, it's gonna get harder, okay? So this time, we're gonna do the opposite of what I say. So if I point that way, we're gonna turn this way. If I point that way, we're gonna turn this way. If I point up, we're gonna go down. Down, you're right. And if I point down, you're gonna go up. up. Okay, I'm very tricky. So don't let me fool you, Ella and Sophia. Here we go. Let's get those feet going fast. Ready, and down. Ah, I, I fooled spider Pig Kid Man. Get those feet going, and up. Nice, and that way. Oh good, and that way. Oh, I tricked some people, and down. Oh, did you go up? Good, and up. And that way, and that way, and that way. And up, and down. Oh, I tricked you, I tricked some people, I tricked some people, and down again. And up, and go that way. And stop, good job. Did I trick you? I'm pretty tricky, I'm pretty tricky. I think I might have got you. Now, we've been working this week. 
we've been working on push-ups. So we're gonna practice our push-ups because tomorrow we're gonna see how many push-ups we can do. So with push-ups, what are some things that are important that we remember? Do we want our hips way up in the air? That's a cat push-up. That's a cat push-up. We don't want that. Do we, we want, want our hips? We don't want our hips low either. We, we, want, we don't want them a little bit in the middle. We want them right in the middle. We want it right in the middle. So let's take a look. Let's come down to the ground, just like this. And I want you to try to raise your hips way up in the air. Everybody raise your hips way up in the air. Now, put your hips way down on the ground. That doesn't feel right. Now I want you to put your hips right in the middle. And we're gonna hold it there. We're gonna hold it there. Matt, should we count in Chinese? Yeah. Count in Chinese, let's hear it loud. To, to 20. pretty hard. So watch. This is how we go into the lava. Why do we have to get even more hot by going into the lava? I know. The lava's hot too. Now let's see those hips. Let's see those hips. Okay, now we're going to slowly go down to the lava. Go as slow as you can. Go as slow as you can. And oh, rest. Come back up. Good job. Alright, let's see if you can go even slower. Can anyone go slower than me? Let's see if anyone can go slower than me. Oh, how slow can you go? How slow can you go? How slow, that's it, good, and one more, and one more, here we go. We're gonna go down so slow, who can go all the way down slow? Oh, who can go slower? Who can go slower than me? Who can go slower than me? Oh, that is so hard, that is so hard. Now, let's go and stand up. Practice those push-ups, because tomorrow we're gonna see how many push-ups you can do. Now I'm gonna race you now. We, I, I tried to trick you, I tried to do other things, but now it's a race, me against you. And here's how that race goes. I want you to stand here just like this on both feet. So let's show them, just like this. Now I want you to put your paintbrush together. This, you can see it right there, that's your paintbrush. Now when I say go, we're gonna write the numbers in the air. So if I say one, we're gonna draw a number one, but notice how big I drew that number one. This isn't a number one. Let's see a number one, Spider Freak Kid Maddie. That's it. A number one would be big. So number one would be all the way above our head, all the way down to the floor. That's a number one. A number two would be a big, huge number two all the way down to the floor. Here's the race. We're gonna, sp we're gonna count from one to 10, and we're gonna spell those numbers, we're gonna write those numbers in the air. I wanna see if you can count out, if you can draw out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10 faster than I can. Now remember, we gotta use your whole body when we're drawing those numbers. I wanna see who my speed demons are, and let me know who beats me. Here we go, because I don't think anyone's gonna beat me, but here we go. All right, you ready, Spider Freak Kid Maddie? Put your paintbrush together. Ready and good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and, and ten. Good job. I think I won. I think no, I. Won. You won. I won. Well, we're gonna have one more race. We're gonna go backwards from 10 to one. So we're gonna start at 10. Here we go. Hands together, get that paintbrush. Hands out just like this. And let's draw a 10. Whew. That's it, good. Nine, Whew. eight, seven, six, five. That's it, four, three, two, one. And, oh my goodness, our hearts are beating so fast. Did anybody beat me? Did anybody beat me? I don't think so. Well, that was a big challenge today. Everybody did 
so good. But here's your extra challenge. Remember last week, we did the breathing ball. We did the breathing ball earlier this week. What I want you to do is I want you to practice some breathing because breathing, when we do sports or when we run or do things like that, we end up breathing really hard. You can hear me breathing really hard. So what I want you to do is I want you to put your hands on your belly button. Just like this, yes, let's go and stand up. Let's put your hands on your belly button, just like this. Now what I want you to do is I want you to breathe, just like this, but I want you to feel the air come into your tummy. So it's gonna look like this. Watch the hands on my tummy. I'm gonna make a big belly. Wait, Zach, you think you won? Zach Huber, you think you won? No way. Now I want you to breathe. Wait, wait, so that was Sarah, Maya, and Naomi all beat me? Oh no. Now keep that hands in the belly, breathe in and out. How big of a belly can you make when you breathe? And out. And breathe in. And out. And breathe in. And breathe out. Very good. Now I'm excited because I got a lot of names to read off for the Clean Room Club. So mom and dad, if your kids are in the Clean Room Club, make sure to let me know here. So let's take a look. Who do we have in the Clean Room Club? The official list, right? Wait, Praju says she won. Lucy says she beat everyone. What? All these people saying they beat me, no way. Now here is the Clean Room Club. We have Madison Clicka, we have Zach Huber, Max Huber, Sasha Bellamy, Naomi Bellamy, Maya Bellamy, Jackson Braddock, Benny Braddock, Jackson Bimmerly, Praju Venkatasami, Owen Needham, Ayla Mays, Henry Needham, Emma Hogan, Ellie Perkins, Ryan Perkins, Sophie Diot, Shruti Nagda, Tanner Brady, Brooklyn Brady, Sydney Kinsler, Caitlin Kinsler, Callie Eisenberg, Silas Bohm, Jesus Carder Cardoso, Elena Cardoso, and Satsuko Chikoi. Nice job. And some people want to know how old Spider Fit Kid Maddie is? How old is Spider Fit Kid Maddie? Six years old. And Mateo, you've done a very good job. I'm going to put you on the list for tomorrow. Good job. Oh, and Lucy Klicka. I like that last name. Looks like she has a clean room too. I'm going to put you on the list. All right now, tomorrow, very important. Spread the word. Tomorrow, we're going to be at a special time. We're going to be at noon. Noon Pacific. We're usually at 11 and we're going to be at noon Pacific tomorrow. Okay, special time tomorrow. Tomorrow is beach day. Tomorrow is beach day. So no matter, even if it's snowing outside, we're going to dress like we're going to the beach. So we're looking forward to seeing you tomorrow. Moms and dads, Please share the word. Let's get thousands of kids around the world moving. That's our goal here with Spider Fit Kids. Let's put some positivity into their life. Let's get them to move. Let's get them to feel good. It's good for the whole family. So go and spread the word right here at Spider Fit Kids. If you want to have some parents or adults that if they want access to all of these workouts, of all of these, we've put all of last week's classes at spiderfitfree.com. They can download all of them in, in a little manual. They can download all of them at spiderfitfree.com. I see Shruti says she won. Shruti, I beat everybody, I think. Oh, these people think they won. But we'll see you tomorrow at 12 o'clock Pacific. Be safe, have a great day, smile. We'll see you later.